Hello guys, welcome back to Touring Guys, it's Jacob here. If you think I'm in kind of like a different location, I am, I'm back at home. I start a placement. Oh my, eyes eye's a bit bloodshot. Oh, oh. Anyway, I start placement tomorrow. So, yeah, front line, ambulance. So, I'm ecstatic, to say the least. Got me uniform, right there. But I just wanted to show you guys what sort of stuff we take on placement, like... Well, how do you take on a 12 hour shift on an ambulance? It's not like you have a locker to put in. You just have to take like a bag. <laughs> Got like a little kit, wait, like a survival kit, I guess. But yeah, those are my shifts right there. Um, yeah, that's my st study stuff. If you're wondering, um, if you guys are starting uni on ambulance or paramedic science, one of these is vital it's a JR calc it is pretty much the bible of the paramedic and it has everything you need in there so yeah it's pretty much the bible of the ambulance service it's really good um i'll show you guys what i'm taking this is my bag it's currently full of stuff i wanted to test that out before i um you know did anything really but yeah i'll lay it all out on my bed i'll show you guys why i'm taking it yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye bye. This is an overview of everything that will fit in my bag, including my bag. Um, I'll start off from the top round here. This is a spare kit, so just in case anything happens, like you know, you get any fluids on you. Spare kit, shower. Yeah, apparently it's a good idea to take one. High vis, um, either when it's cold or you know, yeah. <laughs> um, RTCs as well. Same with the helmet. I wrote my name on this one, so I don't lose it. it, is it? Uh, this is my study stuff, so this has everything to do with my placement hours in it. Lunchbox, big one. I thought I'd get a big one and put some snacks in it. Bottle, need to stay hydrated. These aren't just for looks, just in case I'm seeing that front is quite sunny. I need to see. Um, yeah, so. It's just to stay clean throughout the shift if I get anything on my face or anything like that, or if I'm too hard, I wipe this on the back of my neck. Smell nice. Also, um, also to see, glasses. Forgot about that. So I'll put, pack that. Pack that. And also, I like to take some hand sanitizer with me. This is not hand sanitizer, but hand cream with me. This is like body shop stuff. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty much about it. One more thing is in here. Sorry, it's just I'm like almost completely packed and packed and stuff. So there's like a uh, little fleece that I'll wear up there. And yeah, that's all my stuff that'll go in my bag on the ambulance service. <laughs> this is mad. Uh, what kit am I using on my person? Well, here it is. Okay, this is my stethoscope, the Lippman one, about like ninety pound. But, you know, fob watch, cleaning, hand sanitizer. Also taking a torch, just in case there's anything dark. No, oh, I'm scared of dark. Just yeah. Pens and also a pencil. I have to be careful with that just in case I fall out and stuck myself. But yeah, that's pretty much about it. What I'm taking on placement. So yeah, guys, that is pretty much about it. Um. I'm also going to be taking some snacks with me. Um, I think it's good, especially on your first placement, to get a good rapport pretty much straight away. So I'm probably going to buy like a bag of sweets or something, just take on the ambulance with me and offer it, offer it to my crewmates. At the end of the day, they're taking time out of their shifts and being really understanding with a student like me, especially on my first shift. So I think it'll be a good way to break the ice. And yeah, but the problem is, what the bloody hell do I get? Like, what the f I can, I'll probably just get some chocolates. Like, who doesn't like chocolate? Yeah, yeah. Um, that's what I'm taking on placement. All this is really important. And it's also vital to get a big bag. So, have a look around. This bag's quite big. It's also waterproof. I was looking for a waterproof bag, just because like, there will be times where we'll be walking to placement. Um, I don't want to be like, taking ages, and when it's like, raining, I don't want, that's a fair I'm so sorry, my eyes look so blood shot. I don't know why. Wow. Oh, well. You guys might have to deal with that for a second. Um, 
yeah, so I might be walking placement, it might be raining, so I thought I might as well get that sorted before anything else happens. The bag was about 12 to 15 pound, so yeah, it's really good quality actually. Um, I wish I had some side straps on it, but it'll do. It's great, it's massive, it fits everything in, and yeah, really have a look for a good bag. If you have the money, definitely go out. Um, if you don't really drive, I recommend a bag to go on your back. If you do drive a lot, maybe a sports bag, that might, you know, help. But don't get anything too big, just because you have to fit it on the ambulance. We do have space, just not a lot. <laughs> it's like a little cupboard on the side of the ambulance with people stopping. But yeah, um, this has just been a quick video on what I'm taking a placement. Um, my placement starts tomorrow. I am on a 9 to 9, 12 hour shift. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you find this video helpful, just let me know. And yeah, that would probably mean the world to me. Uh, let me know if you found this video helpful. And if you did like this video, like and subscribe. I would consider that, please. We are so close to 2000, it's unreal. Uh, like and subscribe. Comment down below what you liked about this video. And yeah, sorry about my eyes. I don't know what's... I might rub them. Oh, well. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching, guys. It's been Jacob for Turing, guys. Like, subscribe, have a great day, and if you guys are on placement currently, hope you have a fantastic placement, and good luck if you get on placement in the future. Bye. Um, I'm going to do a quick video of me packing up my stuff, but it might be good to see, good for you guys to see how I'm packing it all. Helmet's going in first, so yes, um, I could like, put stuff in the helmet, that's why it's just like a hot made project. But, yeah, you guys will be watching me pack. Don't know if that's going to be boring or not. I'll pass it. That's what the bag looks like once it's all packed. I did leave a few things out, just like, you know, I'll probably wear these in the morning. Yeah, so I'll probably leave some stuff out. Yeah, that is what I'm taking. That is the bag. I'll have to unpack it later just so I can put the lunch in. Jacket is staying out, so I'll probably wear that. That's staying out, so definitely wearing that. Yeah, 